Yesterday, Apple unveiled iOS 12 at its annual WWDC conference. This is the software that will define the experience of 2018's new iPhones, and also update current iPhones and iPads when it comes out to devices in late 2018, likely September. Developers will be able to get the preview software today. Read, how to download iOS 12 on your iPhone or iPad Apple's Memoji, an animoji you make of yourself. Takes on Samsung's R emoji. Apple rumors prepped us that Apple would save a major iOS overhaul, a redesigned look, rebuilt Siri and reworked Photos app, for a later version of the software, focusing on stability and digital balance with a few flashy additions here and there. The most shocking one for me is Memoji, which is an animoji, animated emoji, that you can create of yourself. Samsung beat Apple to the punch with our emoji in its Galaxy S9 phones, but they were shockingly bad. Apple has a chance to once again popularize a fringe feature that a rival could not. Apple's first hint that we should temper our iOS 12 expectations was this. With iOS 12, we're doubling down on performance, Apple's senior VP of software engineering Craig Fedrighi said on stage at the keynote. iOS 12 will come to all the same devices as iOS 11. Now playing, watch this. Apple unveils Memoji for iOS 12 Apple says it's focusing its efforts on the oldest devices, like the iPhone 6 Plus, $399 at Amazon.com. For example, apps will launch up to 40% faster, and you can slide to take a photo at up to 70% faster than with iOS 11. But that doesn't mean this will be a ho-hum release, and remember, Apple loves saving iOS surprises for its developer preview and for the iPhone release. Expect to see a few more exciting iOS 12 features come to 2018 iPhones. iMessage, make an animoji, Memoji, of yourself Memoji, taking on the Galaxy S9 Zar Emoji, iOS 12 will let you make an Animoji of yourself using the front-facing 3D camera. To make your Memoji feel like you, there are customization options for skin tone, hairstyles, facial features, like freckles, and accessories like sunglasses. Memoji gives you lots of options to choose from. Screenshot by Jessica Hull course slash CNET new Animoji. Apple adds a koala, a ghost, a tiger, and a T-Rex. Longer Animoji videos, Apple extended the cutoff length of Animoji video from 10 seconds to 30 seconds. Stick your tongue out, it's pretty self-explanatory, but now when you stick out your tongue, your animoji does, too. Finally, a mirite. New effects into the messages camera, you'll see filters similar to Snapchat, stickers from your favorite sticker packs, and the ability to put your custom emoji in a chat. Commentary, how Apple's emoji of your face already beats Galaxy S9 now playing. Watch this, customize your Siri with shortcuts. Siri shortcuts burrows deep into your day-to-day -day. Siri's new shortcuts app was created to provide the information and services that Apple thinks you need throughout your day. For example, if you go to a movie, a Siri shortcut can remind you to turn off your ringer. It'll prompt you to call your mom on her birthday, and offer to text your meeting organizer that you're running late, again. And if you do the same thing every day, Siri will identify the repeat behavior on your upcoming schedule and offer actions to help you out. 
So, saying order my coffee can place your usual order. Or you may see a button on your lock screen that offers to do this for you. Commentary Apple's new Siri shortcuts could get annoying fast. Here are the biggest iOS 12 features Apple announced at WWDC 2018. You can create a voice prompt, aka a shortcut, to ask Siri to do something. Find my keys, order my groceries, and game time are examples of what you can program Siri to do. There will be hundreds to download in addition to shortcuts you can create yourself. A new shortcuts app will have a shortcuts editor to help you set up your own quick commands. You can make shortcuts as detailed or numerous as you'd like, they'll run from the iPhone, iPad, HomePod, $349 at Walmart, and Apple Watch, $418 at Sam's Club. FaceTime with 32 of your closest friends group FaceTime will let up to 32 people jump on a conference call at once, audio, video or both. You can switch from a group chat into a group FaceTime. You'll see tiles of your friends and a rosters where you can see all the people in the chat. When someone speaks, their tile automatically enlarges, or you can double tap to bring someone front and center. FaceTime camera also gets an emoji and sticker packs. Now playing, watch this. Now you can group FaceTime with multiple friends do not disturb and screen time aim to curb your phone addiction do not disturb during bedtime. Your device won't show you all the chatty notifications that will keep you up. In the morning, you can tap to keep those notifications coming. This is a new mode in Control Center that you can set up. Screen time. Weekly reports show you how often you use your device, day and night, and how much time you spend in maps. The app gets really detailed, how many notifications from each app, how many per hours, and so on. Now playing, watch this, limit your screen time with iOS 12 app limits, you can set a limit on apps and receive a notification that you've been using an app too long, you set the limit. You can grant yourself an extension, but they'll remind you to move on later on. Set it up for yourself or your kids. You can create allowances, including downtime. You can limit your kids in individual apps, like movies and games. Dismiss notifications, in bulk you'll be able to send notifications from specific apps or simply turn them off for specific apps. Notifications will now be grouped by app, topic, or thread, and you can swipe old notifications away in a group. Now playing, watch this, Apple refreshes photos with new search, sharing features better search in photos search, you can now search for multiple search terms, people, and scenes. For you tab, you'll see recommendations for memories to revisit, suggestions to share photos with your key people and suggestions like apply loop to this photo. Photos share at full resolution out of your iCloud photo library. When a friend receives them, iOS 12 will search their library, assuming they have an iPhone or iPad, too, to suggest pics that they can share with you, in return. R is going to be big the new measure app for iOS 12. Screenshot by Jessica Hill course slash CNET augmented reality is a highlight in iOS 12, where multiple people on their own devices can interact in the same hour experience in real time. Measure app, a new app that uses the phone's camera to measure real-life objects accurately. 
This is important for placing objects, like a new desk you want to check out, in our apps. 3D Graphics Apple wants you to be able to drop any 3D object into the real world, like a toy or lamp or character. To help make it easier for app developers to do this quickly and easily, Apple made a new file format called USDZ, which was developed in conjunction with Pixar. ARKit 2.0, the second version of Apple's R software toolbox for developers is all about making multi-user experiences in VR happen. That means playing games or building LEGO with friends, even sharing a virtual document. ARKit 2.0 also improves face tracking. LEGO's app will let up to four people into the R experience at once. These apps get a refresh news, this app gets a personalized feed of stories from trusted sources. Top stories are hand-picked by Apple's news editorial team. A new browse tab shows you new channels and topics. It's easier to jump to favorites, and a new sidebar lets you dig into other topics. Stocks, new charts show stock performance throughout day. Apple News comes to the Stocks app, as well as top stories and business news curated by Apple Editorial. After hours stock pricing will be added as well. Tap on the headline to get the full article without leaving the app. Stocks is coming to iPad in iOS 12. Voice memos, recordings stay in sync across all of your iOS 12 devices. Now playing, watch this, Apple shows new measure our app books, previously iBooks, books has a new store. Reading now offers a preview that helps you pick up where you left off. CarPlay, it now supports third party traffic apps, Wahoo! What else? There are without a doubt dozens of tiny updates that Apple didn't announce on stage, including Search passwords in Siri Share passwords among iOS 12 devices Better portrait lighting See more battery information Import raw photos from your computer or camera Opt in for critical alerts Like from your doctor Code reader indicates when it's read the QR code E-pad swipe gestures will match iPhone 10 gestures Closer read 12 iOS 12 features Apple didn't mention a WWDC 2018 WWDC 2018 Everything from Apple's Worldwide Developers Conference What we didn't get today A redesigned home screen in iOS 12 VR CNET was first to report that Apple is working on a standalone VR headset for 2020 With an 8K resolution for each eye But we didn't get so much as a wink in this direction Hardware like the iPhone SE 2 or AirPower wireless charging pad That we've been so breathlessly awaiting Jason Parker contributed to this story. Originally published June 2nd, 2018. Update, June 5th at 7.49 a.m. PT. Most recent update after Apple's WWDC keynote.